ain't got no really easy way to say this, man. I just want to, you know, talk about the egg situation real quick, man. I ain't going to say I was a huge fan or anything like that. I did definitely like a couple songs. But I do want to say, man, for a young man like that to basically die to do, like, to gun violence and people kind of, like, praising it or saying it's fake, man, it's, it's real disrespectful, bro. It's, it's like... This is somebody's son, man. And I know his past or whatever. Y'all want to sit here and say he did that, like all this stuff, man. But, you know, you will never know the, the opportunities or the chances that he could have made up for things that he did, man. And to basically be 20 years old, four years younger than what I am right now, man. It's crazy. I, I could really remember being 20. It's crazy to me, man. Because my, my friend two years ago died of gun violence. It was the same situation, got robbed, he was shot twice in the chest, passed away. And just not not technically supposed to die young, man. You always think like, oh, I'ma grow old and I'ma do these great things. And he, he basically made it out the mud, man. He made a name for himself. He did a lot of work to get where he was at. And to go out like that, man, is so freaking tough, bro. Cause it's just like you never really get to experience anything again. Like you can't get out of a casket, bro. You know what I'm saying? You can get out of jail, you can get out of hospital, you can get out of school, you get out of work. You can't get out of a casket. Once you go six feet under, man, it's a wrap. Whatever the hyphen was in between your start date and your end date, you need to make a, a great impact. And I can say that he impacted millions. Um, I one day just want to impact at least a thousand people and they can say that yo Ma, you really was influ influential to me man and I think X did that and to leave his print how he did was amazing I just, I just was really sad that his life had to come to an end and for people to say that <laughs> you know his life doesn't matter or just I seen some crazy stuff on the internet man it's just really disrespectful man I just, damn, man. It's crazy to me, man. And it, it, it's just, it's so much gun violence, bro. It's just, it's ridiculous, man. Just being a young man in America. I ain't gonna put no racial intention in this, man. Just being a young man in America, man. It seems like something like that always happens. And it happens often. And, this time it happened to a, a big public figure. And in the same day, Jimmy Wapo, somebody that was on the come up, gets killed in the drive-by shooting, man. So that's what I'm saying, like gun violence. The guns are too accessible in America. It's something to always say, like, we definitely need to change some of the rules that apply. In Australia, when the massive shooting happened in 1997, when they changed their gun laws, the, the basically the gun violence and crimes went down significantly. But America sees it as, oh, no, everything is fine. It's not the gun laws. You know what I'm saying? Guns hurt people. People hurt people. That's bullshit, man. Because guns are so accessible, man. So much can just transpire, man. I, I really want to say, man, RIP to a young legend, man. I don't want to keep rambling, man. But I think that's real messed up. All out.